Hello. Hello, good evening, teacher. Good evening, teacher. Hello, good evening, teacher. Good evening, how are you? I'm okay, thank you. How was your Wednesday? My I'm fine, what? thank you. <laughs> Everything okay, teacher. It was a normal day. Okay, good. For me, it was very busy. Why? Um, my job, um, right now, uh, we are in an um, income tax period. Income tax. tax. Yes. Income tax time. Like IVA, Pago Cuenta, something like that. Yes. Oh, yes. Well, it's true. It's IVA. Hmm. The tax time, tax season. It's called tax season. Okay, thank you. Tax tax season. Yes. Yeah, every month in El Salvador, like uh, uh, 10 days, uh, the first 10 days, like 12 of the every month, 12 or 15, or 15 day of the month, every month. Yes. Or bi-weekly. Bi-weekly is two weeks. Mm, no. Uh, Eva is monthly. It's every month. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. All right. Uh, anything else? Anything special happened today? Another normal day. It rained today in San Salvador. Did it yeah. rain in your house? It's raining in Samuel too. Really? Yeah, but it's, it's, it's not too much. But it's normal? I think it's not normal. Yeah, because it what doesn't normal? rain in March, no? Yes, sounds fine because that fruit on the season of the, this year, uh, maybe I need to rain in uh, for that, maybe cocotes uh, is the season of the year. Oh, okay. When, when is the rainy season in San Salvador? In El Salvador? Um, middle of May, May uh, so June, normal. Normally, the start of the winter. Okay. Oh, okay. Interesting. Okay. But you see one thing, um, in El Salvador, we don't have winter. Sorry. <laughs> No, no, but no, it's okay. Many people confused. Do you know what is winter? Yeah, <laughs> but Win uh, it's, uh, in El Salvador only past two seasons. Yes. Uh, yes. <laughs> yes, we have wet season and dry season only. Yes. Because only it's, two. It's, it's a tropical country. Yeah, so... <laughs> Yeah, so don't say winter because people, when you say winter, it's, it's cold. Yes. Winter, winter is uh, cold and snowing. Snowing in some countries, in some states, not every state. But, but, winter... it, but the country, uh, you know, uh, is, the rainy is, is not a winter. No. Yeah. No? no, because winter is cold. Cold. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. No, it's okay. In El Salvador, it's a tropical. It's tropical. Tropical weather. weather. Tropical. So countries with tropical weather, it's always hot or warm. So countries with tropical weather only have wet season and dry season. Right? Okay. 
All right, okay, I'm going to, uh, let's share a video. We're going to continue the newest place in town. Let me see if you can see it. Okay, let's hear this. Can you think about fashionable places in your city? Listen to these people talk about the in places and the reasons they give. What's your favorite club, Ben? The Soul Club. They have fabulous music, and it's never crowded, so it's easy to get in. That's funny. There's always a lot. Just opened a few months ago. Everything is brand new. I'm sorry, I'm going to put it again. You think about fashionable places in your city? Listen to these people talk about the in places and the reasons they give. What's your favorite club, Ben? The Soul Club. They have fabulous music, and it's never crowded, so it's easy to get in. That's funny. There's always a long wait outside my favorite club. I like it because it's always packed. Why do you think it's so popular? Well, it just opened a few months ago. Everything is brand new and modern, and lots of fashionable people go there. It's called the Casablanca. Oh, right. It's the newest in place. I hear the reason people go there is just to be seen. Exactly. Do you want to go some night? I thought you'd never ask. Do you ever go to any of these places? Tell us why or why not. All right, so places that are in. What are some places that are in? Discotheque, clubs, nightclubs. But so which ones? Club. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I only go to a bar <laughs> in this moment. I remember, I remember in my time when I was like 20, the places that were in were some um, lapsus. <laughs> um, Senor Frogs. Those places were in. Now I don't know what is in. What what bars? I think Chapal Ch Chapultepec is in. Yes, Chapultepec uh, it is in because of is a cheaper bar. <laughs> Everything costs one and fifty dollars. Yeah, yeah. It's, re it's really affordable. It is. Yeah. <laughs> What about restaurants? What restaurant? Restaurants, I don't know. I don't know is if a restaurant, but uh, I heard about the Willis. Uh, people talk about that. Uh, I don't know if a restaurant or a bar in San Salvador. Teacher is having internet issues. The teacher disappeared. <laughs> I think that la herradura is a. Can you hear me? Uh, yes. Yes. Yes, teacher. yes, teacher. Thank you. Sorry about that. <laughs> no problem. Okay, uh, women. Uh, wow, well, only Anna. Anna, what is what is in for women in this moment? Um, 
I don't know. <laughs> if you don't know, we don't know. <laughs> yes, <laughs> I don't know. Uh, but it related to the the places, um, traditional places in, in downtown. Um, no, no. The, what, what is in for women? In, for example, I don't know. Pandora. No, it's not necessarily like what is in. Que está de moda en las mujeres right now? What is in? I think Pandora. Oh. Pandora. Yes, the Pandora is uh, is the the recently or actually function, maybe. I I I don't know. Is that correct? The word uh, nowadays. Uh, the Pandora is very famous around the world. No, oh, no, only in El Salvador. Okay, but in El Salvador, what is in? Um, in women right now. The, how do you say it? Um, let me see. Bisutería, uh, the accessories of for women, the bracelet, and how do you say collar? No cadena, sino que collar. Collar. Collar, collar. Uh, Irons uh, about artisan, the women made. Okay. Let me write that for you. Handcraft. Handcraft. Okay, yes. thank you. Okay, very good. Um, um, men, what is in for men in this moment? Sure, I think that in in our case, uh, we are very uh, practical. Yes. And, and things like uh, a good life is always in uh, a, a formal uh, shirt, uh, a good uh, shoes, that uh, kind of things uh, never uh, never pass. Yes. Also, um, what music is in in this moment? Music. Not what mu Yes. Not what music do you like? What music is in? I don't know what is the 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 genre. 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 Yeah. Is, Genre. Uh, Billy Eilish. I I hear that. Well, I heard that uh, she is a, a a singer that that everyone hears in, in nowadays. Okay. Yes, uh, that's pop music. Pop music, yes. Yeah. And she she's good. I like uh, I like some of her songs. They're good. Okay. Okay, so that's that's the definition. What is in? So let's see what's next. Do you still see my screen? No. No. No right now. Okay, hold on. Yes, now yes. Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay, good. Let's hear this one then. What's wrong with my internet? Hello. Okay, if you want to give reasons, you may do so by using because. Can you hear? Because. Yes. Of, yes, teacher. Okay. Stay and you will learn not only the meaning, but how to use them. Giving reasons. I like the Casablanca because it's always packed. 
Since it's always so packed, there's a long wait outside the club. It's popular because of the fashionable people. The Soul Club is famous for its fabulous music. Due to the crowds, the Casablanca is difficult to get into. The reason people go there is just to be seen. The reason that people go there is just to be seen. The reason why people go there is just to be seen. To give reasons, we may use because, since, because of, for, due to, the reason that, the reason why, is. Let's begin with because and since. They mean the same, although since is more formal. Because and since are followed by a subject and a verb. Subject plus verb. I love the soul club because the music is great. Because or since can begin or end a sentence. When the clause is at the beginning, it is followed by a comma. Since it's packed, comma, there's a long wait. Or, there is a long wait, since it's packed. The clause with because or since is a subordinated one, not a main clause. Because of and due to. They mean the same, although due to often has a negative connotation. Because of and due to are followed by a noun or a noun phrase. This is my favorite club because of the great music. Because of or due to can begin a sentence. When the clause is at the beginning, it is followed by a comma. Due to the crowd, comma, it's difficult to get into. Or it's difficult to get into due to the crowds. The clause with because of or due to is a subordinated clause, not a main clause. Or for plus noun or noun phrase. It's famous, well-known, popular for its music. The reason that, the reason why is. The reason Julie goes there is to have fun or the reason why Julie goes there is to have fun. Can you answer the following questions given reasons? Why do you think English is so popular? Why do you think there's so much traffic in your city? Write your reasons on our discussion box. Okay, did you understand that? Yes, yes, sure. Yes, yes, yes. yes. I think yeah. it was very self-explanatory. Let's see, it says, read the paragraph and complete it by filling the blank spaces using because, since, because of, for, and do to, and the reason. Type one answer for each space. You, you just need to type the word in the space. No capital letter or period is needed. Hello? Hello? Yes. Hi, I'm sorry. It says, what's wrong with my computer today? Well, with my internet, actually. Sorry about that. It's okay, teacher. It, it, it doesn't load, look. Let me try again. <clears throat> no preview available, this is strange. Okay, let's try it again. Hmm. Did you do this in your house, the reading? Yes, teacher. Okay, look, we will check this tomorrow because the system is not letting me open it. 
Maybe tomorrow, yes, but right now I can't open it. So it's okay, well, we'll do it tomorrow. We'll do 2.9 tomorrow. Let's do listening exercise. This is important. So it says instructions, listen to three radio commercials, advertising business. What are two special features of each place? So listen to Maggie, to Sports Pro, and Mexi Grill. Let's listen to it. Page 82. Can you hear? Exercise. Yes. Eyes yes. 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 Listening. Radio commercials. Listen to three radio commercials advertising businesses. What are two special features of each place? What slogan does each place use? One, Maggie's. Oh, Carol, what a great suit. It looks just like the one I saw in the latest fashion magazine. Is that a... Uh-huh. Wow! But her clothes are so expensive. How can you afford designer clothes? And on our salary? Hey, did you get a raise? No way! You know I'd tell you if I did. Well, there's something you're not telling me. Okay, okay. Well, I found this really great store. They have all the latest fashions. Not last year's stuff that's already out of style. And their prices are just unbelievable. They must be. That's the second new outfit you've worn this week. Where is this place? It's called Maggie's, and it's just around the corner. I'll take you there at lunchtime. Don't wait for your lunch hour. Come to Maggie's now. We've got all the best designer fashions at the lowest prices. And we accept all major credit cards. Remember, if you don't see what you want in your closet, come check out ours. That's great. Two, Sports Pro. Hey, people. What are you going to do this summer? A little fishing? Camping? Maybe finally learn how to play tennis instead of just watching it on TV? Yeah, I know how much you'd like to do these things. If only you had the right equipment. If only you knew what you were looking for when you walked into one of those big sporting goods stores. Well, here at Sports Pro, we want to help you, not confuse you. Our experienced salespeople are knowledgeable. They really know what they're talking about. So, feeling inspired? Good. Now, come on in. No excuses, because we're open every day. Sports Pro, we're here to help you have fun. Three, Mexi Grill. Excuse me, was that your stomach I just heard growling? Hmm, feeling hungry, right? Only you're not sure what you want? Well, close your eyes and picture this. A huge tortilla filled with sizzling pieces of chicken. Should you add fried onion and peppers? Or maybe crispy lettuce and tomato? Or guacamole and spicy salsa? Well, you know what? You can have any of these because we'll add any combination of fillings you want. In a hurry? No problem. We have lots of people waiting to serve you. And check out our low prices. Mexi Grill. You won't find a cheaper, tastier meal anywhere. Okay. So, Maggie's number one. What do you think our slogan was? Lowest prices, accept credit cards. So it's number two. Yes. Yes, yes. Knowledgeable salespeople offering every day. Wait, wait. So number four, Sports Pro is what? Knowledgeable salespeople. 
knowledgeable so every day okay, and thank you every day. Three. Okay. okay number three mexican grill fast service, fast service. Low, prices. low prices okay number four number four is the first one. It's a zero one. All right, let's see if we got it right. We got them right. Okay, here we have um, another reading. I hope we can open. Man, I can't open my readings. I don't know why. Let me check one thing, hold on. Scan the media, people who work in the movies, general public. Mm -hmm. Indian Indian movies. That's the. It's it's called Bollywood. Yeah. Yes. Let me check, please. Hold on. Well, I, I, I can't seem to open my my reading. I don't know why. Okay, but um, what we can do is that we're going to have a little conversation in this moment, okay? So I want everybody to tell me one good thing about you. Remember we did this Monday, I think, last week? Do you remember? No. What we did the last week. No, do you do you remember when we did this? Tell me one good thing about you. Thing about me. What good thing? <laughs> yes. Okay, so uh, this is what we're going to do right now is uh, practice listening and asking questions. So everybody tell me one good habit you have, but please don't say, I brush my teeth. I mean, it's, it's a good habit, but tell me something interesting. For example, imagine I tell you, one good habit I have is I like to read. It's me. Uh -huh. And then, and then you can ask me different questions relacionadas a mi hábito. Yes. So I will start. One good habit I like, I have, is that I like to read. Questions. Uh, what kind of books do you like to read? Um, I like to read controversial books. Or history books. Okay. Questions? What is your favorite author? Oh. Maybe Vargas Llosa, he's good. Yeah, he's really good. Yeah, I like him. Um, how, how many, many times do you spend in read a book? Well, oh, good question. Now, uh, but it's not how many times, it's how much time. Sorry, how much time do you yeah, spend okay. reading a book? You know, now very little time. Unfortunately, I don't read anymore because I don't have time. So I read. Do you on, have a lot of work? Yes, I work from eight to six. I come home. I eat dinner, I play with my son, and then I come teach. <laughs> so uh, 
before I was married, when I was single, I, I read a lot. How many, I, how many, how many books did you read last year? Maybe five, not, not very much. But you wow. know, but now I, I don't really read books, but I do read a lot of biographies on the internet. What kind of sports practice you? What kind of sports? Yes. I like baseball. But remember the topic right now, my good habit is reading. Oh, sorry. No, it's okay. Uh, what what kind of what kind of gender of no, what gender of food do you like? But class, remember that when it's reading, you don't it's not necessarily books. I mean, it's reading in general. Yes. Um, Naftali, I like controversial topics. Teacher, what do you think about audiobooks? I I I like them. In English, they're good. Teacher. Yes. Do you do you read a uh, book enough? Which one? Have you read it? The book uh, of Enoch. No, maybe not. Maybe, I don't think so. Teacher. Yes. Excuse me, teacher. What is the most interesting thing uh, you have read? You have read. Um, Maybe about the Holocaust. Really? Yes. That was interesting. What kind of the other uh, uh, readers you says that don't, that don't say uh, books? I'm sorry, I don't understand. Okay, I think uh, if you say that uh, not only read books, uh, says oh, the kind oh, of no, I mean, authors. because, no, because siento que se están enfocando más en libros y no en reading. <laughs> so remember, when, when, when you say I like to read, because now you can read a book in the internet. Yes. Wow. You, you can read Wikipedia. Yeah, some magazines and internet too. Yes. Also, okay. nadie me preguntó, what is your favorite book? <laughs> what is your favorite book? Well, my favorite book is Don Quixote. Really? Why did you? I know I something it. about that. I like Don Quixote, he's crazy. <laughs> Don Quijote Sancho Panza. Yes. Con su dulcinea. <laughs> yes. I don't, I, like a, <laughs> I don't read the books, but I see them. Some movies about Don Quijote. I think oh, right there. You watch the movies? Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> it's a good book. Okay, now, uh, Maria, tell me what is one good habit you have? Please don't repeat, I like to read. Tell me a different habit. Who is Maria? Who is Maria? Teacher? I'm sorry, I'm sorry, Anna. <laughs> Anna Molina, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay. okay, no problem. Where, where are my glasses? I'm sorry about that, Anna Molina. I good habit. Um, I like, um, I, how um organized a, I am organized. Yes, I am organizing my house and everything. Okay. Okay, class questions. So Anna is organized. Ask her questions. Do you have a schedule for for make all the things? 
No, I don't have any schedule, but I try to follow the, the routines every day. Are you, are you, um, are you obsessed? No. With cleaning? Oh, a, a little, a little, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> because I, I, I have, when my families, um, how do you say tirar? I don't remember. Throw? Throw the things in a floor or in a table. I bother me when the, someone throw the, the things. <laughs> okay. Okay. Uh, questions? Yes. Uh, 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 do you have uh, some uh, things that you prefer to organize? Size? Uh, I don't know. Mm, not exactly, but I try to, for example, in my room, uh, I organize my thing every day. Every day. Um, in the afternoon, in the morning, in my in my room, yes, every day I organize uh, all the things I have. <laughs> Do you have a pattern? Sorry? Do you have a pattern? No. Un patron, like when you clean, do you have a pattern like no, alphabetical exactly. or colors? Uh, exactly. Or from Maybe small to big? I start to organize uh, or clean the the wind the window or the middle. I don't have any parole. Okay, that's good. Would you because, like um, some someone? Some people have you? patterns. <laughs> that they, they separate by colors, alphabetical, from small Yes, in my case, big. no. Only try to organize according to the, the cloth or the thing, maybe the blouse or jeans or shorts. Separate only for the kind of clothing, okay. of cloth, sorry. Excuse me, excuse me, Anna. And do you organize uh, some e events in your family, or just yes, the yes, all event, the time. Uh, team? <laughs> yes, all the time. I organize that uh, my brother's birthdays or my father's birthdays or different events in my family because I have a big family. And I try to give an idea according to the, the holiday or maybe birthday. Uh, you have 14 <laughs> brothers, correct? <laughs> no, I have uh, 11 siblings. <laughs> 11 siblings. Yeah. How much, how much time do you spend to make your organization? Uh, who, my my room or all the all or my house? In going my house, I I I don't know. Maybe Both. the whole morning uh, from to eight to eleven a.m. <laughs> oh, okay. All right. Okay. Thank you. Awesome. Uh, Please, Eva, Evaristo, what is one good habit you have? Well, um, I like to watch movie, drama, drama movies. Okay, and why is that a good habit? Uh, excuse me. Okay, why why is watching movies a good habit? Um. Okay. Um. In my case, um, I'm learning English, so. I watch movie in English, so very good. I, yeah, um, in drama, drama movies is is good for me because I I like to history 
uh, real real life uh, uh, metaphoric uh, you know uh, so many so many movies uh, they have a metaphoric you know like uh, uh, something uh, made me think about it. Uh, made me a uh, good human being. Uh, that's, um, that's why um, I like to watch movies like, like that. Okay, okay, that's good. What is your favorite movie? Um, let me see. Um, I like to the, uh, I don't know in English, how do you say trilogia, the Batman? The Batman trilogy. Tri trilogy, yes. And I like the, the Lord of the Ring uh, and uh, The Hobbit. Okay, so you like science fiction movies? Yes, yes. Or epic movies. Yes, and Narnia. And Narnia. Did you watch um, El Laberinto del Fauno, I think? Um, uh, no. I never I watched that movie, but I, I heard it's good. Yeah, yeah. Me too, me too. I heard about it, but I, I, I don't, I, I didn't, I didn't watch it. Okay, okay. Moises, tell us what is one good thing about you, sir? Okay, a good habit uh, that I have uh, because of my work is that I try to do exercise uh, five uh, times a week at least. Okay, so you are organized. In some in some way, yes, because if you want to to do exercise, you have to uh, uh, dedicate uh, a couple of hours every day to do that activity. Okay, I see your point. Yes. Uh, what about your girlfriend? Uh, she likes. She likes to do exercise, but especially swimming. Oh, okay, okay. In my case, I, I like to swimming. I like to go to the gym, play football. Maybe I am not so good as uh, Mariano, <laughs> but I, I is is the thing is uh, have fun uh, making some sports. Okay, good point. Good point. Thank you, sir. Okay, yeah. Neftali, can you tell us something good about yourself? A good habit that you have? Okay, in my case, I like to be responsible with my homework and my activities. So that's a, a good habit that I have. Um, I like to, I like play the guitar. You like to play guitar, good. Who is your favorite guitarist? My favorite guitarist is... Uh, Carlos Santana. Okay, can you play Carlos Santana? Mm, I play one song. The, Which the song one? Is... Flor de Luna. No, it's, I don't remember, but it's, it's like a, a Mexican song. It's, I call it Chachita. Oh, okay. Yeah, I never heard that. But okay, good. Do you play in a band? Uh, sorry? Do you play in a band? No, I like to play alone. Well, my, I like to play acoustic. I don't like the electric guitar. Okay, okay, good. Thank you, sir. Thank you for sharing your, your good habit. What, okay. about you? what about you, Evaristo?
I already I already mentioned my habit. I'm sorry, what was your habit? I like to watch movie English. Oh, I'm sorry, movies. I'm sorry. It was not you, Evadisto, it was Mariano. Hi. Well, uh, I'm sorry, que cambian las, las, <laughs> la ventanilla. Don't worry. Okay, a good habit that I have is I always want to learn something new. For example, uh, recently I started to learn French using a Japanese technique called Kaizen. Kaizen means small change. You have to make a, a small change in your day to if you want to learn something. And that's the way that I started to learn French. I started French from 7 p.m. to 7.30 p.m. And I started to learn some words on a basic level. Wow, no, say, something, say something in French. Okay, for example, if you want to say the dress is red, is le robe rouge. The wolf, uh, le loup, the elephant, le lepon. Uh, cheese a uh, fromage the car is japan uh, is from japan la portière is japanese if you want to say uh, this is a strange a strange word so if you want to say egg is le, le of is is a really hard word to pronunciate and to write is lay off in kinds of like that. Only uh, small. But you can't say, for example, je m'appelle, correct? Yeah. Je m'appelle David. <laughs> or the vin est bon. Uh, the wine is, is good. The wine is good. The du, vin est bon. The vin est bon. Yeah. But I can re I remember that I you don't like the wine. <laughs> yeah. I love the wine, the red wine. Okay. Mm -hmm. And that's it. I have it. Who means is good. Yeah, but good for for drinks, for, for things like that. Okay. Is, so is, I, I, I can't say I can't say Messi is the boo. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but not today, only for one goal. Oh man, yes. Today was horrible. <laughs> okay, good. All right, class, very good. Now let's practice. Let me see how, how good your practice is. Let me see, Moises, are you there, sir? Yes, yes. Can you tell me what is Anna's good habit? Uh, she spoke... But you have to answer complete. Anna's good habit is? Okay, Anna's good habit is that she is organized. Very good, thank you, good listening. Anna, what is Evaristo's good habit? Mm. Evaristo's good habit is, let me see, watching a movies. Watching movies. Good, Evaristo, what is Neftali's good habit? The Neftali good habit is a... Uh, responsible and play guitar. Then he plays guitar, good. Neftali, what is Jose Ramirez good habit? Uh, I don't say my good you habit because I don't have <laughs> good habit. Yes, yes. Neftali, what is Jose Mariano's good habit? Um, Jose Mariano Sabid is uh, speak French. Uh, that was not his good habit. It was related, yes. Who remembers Jose Mariano's good habit? Study, learn. He likes to learn new things. Yes, learning new things using yes. uh, Japan. Japanese technique. <laughs> yeah, and Jose Mariano, I'm sorry, how is that technique? You have to use a, a small part of your time 
to learn something new in your life. And, and, but basically, this is the technique. You have to spend 30 minutes to learn something new, like uh, language, uh, mathematics, physics, uh, make it exercise. But this small change could be a big change in your life. This yeah. is the essence of the technique. How okay. many how many minutes? Excuse me. What? How many minutes do you spend when you learn a new thing? Like ten minutes or five minutes? You choose your time. You choose your, the part of the day. If you want to learn fast, you have to spend more time. If you want to learn slow you have to spend 30 minutes 15 minutes if you want but depends uh depends of you how fast or how 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 low you want to learn something or do something all right thank you man. very good okay uh jose ramirez do you remember my good habit Yes, uh, let me think. Do you, do you like to read? Very good, yes, you like to read. Do you remember my favorite book? Yes, uh, it was uh, Don Quixote. All right, very good class. All right, now let's do one more round, but this time, bad habits. <laughs> What is a bad habit you have? All right, so uh, example, let me give you my bad habit and I need to change this. I don't pay attention. I don't pay attention. Sometimes my wife is talking to me and I say, uh-huh, uh-huh, yes, uh-huh, uh-huh. And I'm not listening. Why, teacher? I don't know. I am, I don't know. But I don't know why it's only with my wife or, or my father or, because in my job, I do pay attention. But I don't know, that's a bad habit. What about you, Moises? What is one bad habit you have? Uh, one bad habit. I think that we, as a human, we have a lot of bad habits. Uh, and every day we are spending time uh, with this bad habit. But if I could say one, in my case, is that I am uh, angry in some cases that uh, I, I don't have to do I, I don't have to be angry. Uh, for example, uh, when I am talking and, and, and some people that's, uh, don't understand me, that makes me angry in some way. Okay. I'm sorry, I don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm joking. Okay. All right, Jose Ramirez, do you have a bad habit? Yes, I, I think I, I, I have some ones like that. I am, I don't know. It's like Moises, I, I get upset sometimes, but uh, yeah, they, maybe my bad habit is that I sometimes I, I don't uh, be friendly with people. I, I am not friendly with people. I am not friendly with people. I am so serious with people. I don't talk uh, a lot. Oh, okay. Yeah. Okay. I see. Uh, sometimes that's a bad habit. Okay. What about you, Neftali? Do you have a bad habit? Uh, my bad habit is
I'm I I got to the you know, the bed later. Late. Late, sorry. I get to the bed late. So what time do you get to bed? Uh, 12 a.m. Okay. And what time do you wake up? I wake up to 9 or 8.30 a.m. Oh, that's not bad. That's good. But sometimes I wake up to 10 a.m. Oh, okay. Bad is if you go to sleep at 12 and you need to wake up at 6 in the morning. Okay. Do you work in this moment, <laughs> Naftali? Um, for the moment, I work in, uh, in the morning, but not all the days. Oh, but okay. Maybe my habit is to uh, wait late. Wake up late. I like to sleep. Yes. And I like to sleep a lot. And what do you work or where do you work? Uh, I mentioned that I work in a call center. Call yes, in a call. Oh, yes. In the performance. performance. Yes. I, I worked six hours. Okay. In the morning or in the afternoon? And sometimes I work in at in morning, and um, and sometimes I work in the middle as afternoon. Nice. Okay. All right. Good. Anna, what is your bad habit? I'm very impatient. <laughs> <laughs> really? Yes. I don't have passion because uh, when I when I want to everything doing yes. uh, mm -hmm. I try to to do it uh, quickly because I don't have passion for waiting for example for waiting uh, when I went to the doctor and I have appointment and I start for a long time I waiting for a long time. Sorry, uh, I'm very impatient. I'm trying to walk uh, around the the living the living room in a clinic. <laughs> I I watching uh I checking my cell phone. I walk in, and and I sit front of the clinic and watching a TV or read a magazine. I don't have passion, <laughs> any passion. Oh, okay. But it's a, it's a bad habit for me. Okay, okay, no, it's okay, Pay. okay. What about you, uh, Evaristo, what is a bad habit you have? Uh, well, uh, I have some, some, but um, now I, I think in one bad habit is uh, when I drive, be in traffic. How do you say pitar, pitar? Beep, okay, beep, when I drive, okay, pitar is honk. Hum, yeah, honk. 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 Mm -hmm. uh -huh. You honk? Yeah, but I, I, that's, that's, mm, uh, my problem in El Salvador. Yes. When I, when I draw. I, I don't <laughs> like when people honk. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know, sometimes the, the, the traffic light is in red. Yeah. And then suddenly it's green. Okay. Yeah. And ni he terminado de cambiar el color. Beep, 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 beep. Yeah. Like, really, man? Wait. <laughs> Yeah, last last year I went to New York and my friend gave me his car through drive and home and he said, "Hey, don't do that, man." And and it's, I think it's about 
bad habits. Yes, I, it's a. <laughs> no, and it's also dangerous because someday you will get somebody angry. Yeah, yeah. Oh. <laughs> and I don't, I don't follow, I don't follow the traffic rules. You know, you have to stop at the stop sign. And now, sometimes, sometimes, uh, I don't, I don't stop. Uh, Why? Uh, I don't know. Maybe uh, is. Um, I don't know. It's a bad, bad habit. <laughs> yes, be careful. Be careful <laughs> yeah, because yeah. it can be a fatal accident for you or another person. Yes, yes. <laughs> okay, but no problem. Let me see. Let me see. Jose Mariano, do you have a bad habit, sir? Yes, teacher. I think that my biggest bad habit is sometimes it turns into uh, ingoing people. <laughs> for example, oh. while in the party. I just take my beer, like I said, and I don't want to talk with anybody. <laughs> oh, wait, so I'm sorry, can you repeat the bad habit? It uh, turns into uh, ingoing people. Ingoing. Yeah. I don't want to talk with anybody. Okay, Introvertido, good. introvertido. Oh, okay. Okay. So, yeah, okay, no, definitely, I understand you. But what is this? I am not a people person. Oh, you never heard that? Yeah, it's es una expresión. Por ejemplo, um, hay gente que no le gusta ir a concierto porque no le gusta público. Uh -huh. Entonces, you say that I am not a. ¿Saben cómo dice público en inglés? Crowd. Crowd. Yes, so you say, I am not a crowd person. Oh. Si no me gustan los clubs nocturnos, como diría? I don't know. I am not a, a nightclub person. Oh. Mm -hmm. Crowd person? Oh, sí, nightclub so person. Uh-huh. So you say I am not lo que es y you finish with person. Uh, yeah. For example, I am not I am not um, a party person. Sure per person. Excuse me? Sure. Church? How do you say? English? Oh, church. Church. Very. Oh, yeah. Definitely, I am not a church person. <laughs> Me too. I am not. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's, bueno, si alguien dice, no, yo no soy una persona religiosa, you say, I am not a religious person. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, podemos decir man. I am not a religious man. Hey, vamos todos a tomarnos coffee. Ah, oh, man. No, I am not a coffee man. Mm. Vamos a un bar. You say, no, I'm not a bar man. Why? Because people. <laughs> no, but you know, sometimes because people smoke. Uh. And I don't like smoke, so I, I don't like bars. Example, right? And yeah, but that I am not a barman. I am. I love bars. <laughs> well, you know the prob the problem I feel that with bars today. I don't like I don't like talking like this. Ah, oh yeah. <laughs> ah, I like I like for example I like bars like in a hotel. Right? Yeah. You know. No the music, music is not, is not yes. so loud. And you can actually drink and talk to people. Yeah, it's great. Mm -hmm. But but now bars, oh, todos son karaoke. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> do you know, do you know um, Neptunos? Uh, yeah. 
I like Neptunos. It's not a fancy bar. It's not. But I like Neptunos because the beer, they serve very, very cold. And boquitas are good. But I like to go to Neptunos maybe Saturday at 1 p.m. A la una. Because it's empty. No, no, no noise. Hey, you no, know, you have one drink, two drinks, two beers, and that's it. But Neptunos at nine at night is karaoke and full. And it's crowded. And it's crowded. And I don't like that. <laughs> I sometimes, think that once I be here. Yeah, sometimes I'm not a people person. <laughs> <laughs> sometimes it happens. Yeah, sometimes it happens. But but you know anybody todos tenemos like like things like that right okay class tomorrow we're going to continue this mañana vamos a hablar con qué son cosas que no le hábitos que ustedes no le gustan la gente okay like right. for example I don't like <laughs> <laughs> I don't like that pero a veces no tengo que usar like when you're in a pupuseria or in a bar, hola, hola, disculpe, y no oyen, ni modo. Ah, ah, ah. Todo <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I don't like when people touch me. You know, like when people touch me, like, what? Don't touch me. <laughs> okay, so... um. Or when people eat with their mouth open. Making noise. <laughs> yes, and then you see all the food in the mouth. Uh, I have one of my best friends. No, mi mejor amigos hace eso, man. And uh, yo digo, no entiendo cómo puede salir de buenos lugares haciendo eso. Porque empieza. Really, man, he's crazy. Yes. Okay, so that's what we're going to do tomorrow. Okay, so we'll continue tomorrow. Okay, okay teacher. Good night to everyone. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye-bye. Good night. Bye-bye.